what to do when recovery mode doesn't work on Mac. Fix recovery mode with Time Machine. First, restart your Mac. Press and hold the Option key on your keyboard when you hear the startup sound. Then connect your Time Machine drive to your Mac. It will take some time for it to boot. Choose the recovery drive to launch your Mac. You'll see the Use Disk button. Click on it to update the system storage. Use Internet Recovery Mode. First, restart your Mac. Simultaneously hold down, Option, Command, and R key on your keyboard until you see a globe photo and progress bar. Select the internet connection that you're using, enter the network password, and wait for a while. You'll see the recover mode window pop up. Click on reinstall Mac OS and then on continue. Follow the steps to continue the installation process. Create a bootable installer. Open App Store and search for a Mac OS installer that you want to use. Click on Get and download the installer. When the installer window pops up, go to the upper menu bar, click on the installer menu and click on Quit Mac OS Installer. Open Finder and go to Applications. Find the installer by the name of Install Mac OS. Right click on it and click on Show Package Content. Go to the Contents folder and then to the Resources folder. Find the Create Install Media file. Press Command and Space keys on your keyboard to open Spotlight, and enter Terminal to open it. In the Terminal window, type in sudo, and press the Space key on your keyboard. Drag the Create Install Media file to the Terminal window and type in hyphen, hyphen, volume, and press the Space key. In the Finder window, simultaneously press Shift, Command and G key on your keyboard. In the bar, enter, slash, volumes. Plug your USB drive into your Mac you'll see your drive appear in the Volumes folder. Drag your drive to the same terminal window. In Terminal, press Enter key on your keyboard, and enter your user password. The password characters won't be shown in the terminal window. When asked if you wish to continue, enter the letter Y. After the disk is erased and the data is copied to your USB, remove it from your Mac. Shut down your Mac. Press and hold the Option key on your keyboard and then turn on your Mac. When you see the same screen as shown in the video, connect the USB with a bootable installer to your Mac. Click on your created bootable installer. Wait for a while, you'll see the recovery mode window pop up. Click on reinstall Mac OS and then on continue. Follow the steps to continue the installation process. Thank you for watching.